I know I'm starting yet another vlog with aquarium footage, but what can you do? Look at this chaos. I put an algae wafer in there and we have a mystery snail, four of the big guys and so many babies here. I do love that when they all accumulate like that. Very adorable. Also, they're cleaning off the snail. It's it's quite adorable. What a mess. So we're at the, what's it called? I forgot, Maryland State Fair. Uh. The fairgrounds, Simonian fairgrounds. Yes, and we're going to the crafts festival, the Sugarloaf Craft Festival. At I don't. We think that's what we're doing. Yeah, no, we're there's. Find it. There's a sign that said crafts festival. We were uh, walking to the jewelry show, which is over there, which is a little confusing. But yeah. It's normally, where they have horse races and stuff. Yes. So, I mean, not here. I mean, that's I they do they do things with horses. Pretty pretty gift boxes. Yeah. No. Guys, you gotta check this out. <laughs> Seriously. They're so good. Oh, you really? Oh, okay. I love the pine cone. Thank you. Talk to here. Yeah, wow. Great. Kind of guess, uh, somewhat blown away. First him, now this. Blown, get it? Guess one. Ha, oh, guess one. Ha. Oh. Didn't you guess one just eat recently? Yeah. How cool is that? There's a double radiometer. <laughs> double radiometer all the way. Oh my gosh, they're so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> you just said, what would you do with them? I don't know. Sit Collect. On yeah. a tiny shell. Oh, this is. Wow. I like that's my favorite. So one of the problems you have at a craft fair like this is that there are a lot of paintings and photos and you know art. Uh, and the big problem of that is you don't want to film that because it's copyrighted and the artists don't like it when you do that. So you gotta be careful to not catch anything like that. I already got some really angry uh, eyes on me because <laughs> I, I, I swayed the camera past something. I'm not taking photos, I'm just filming. But, you know, that happens. Uh, wait, wait, what do you get? Some handmade soap. Ooh, soap. It's my weakness. Ooh, smells good. Yeah. I got it, don't worry. Can't, can't, can't go wrong. Look at these hand carved flowers. Ooh. Look at this hat. Hey Lauren. Yeah? You like soap? Yeah. <laughs> it's my weakness. Your only weakness, it's your kryptonite. Your good, well smelling kryptonite. After some people were looking really angry <laughs> at me. Huh. Ah, I just committed a build. Fantastic. I'm currently trying to fix what I've done wrong with my app and uh, Apple is not happy with it. Why am I so yellow? I'm so yellow. I'm so yellow. Camera, come on. I'm not, I'm not that yellow and like in real life, I look like I have some sort of disease. So I've actually restructured my room a little bit. I changed things up a little bit. I actually went from three monitors to two. I moved a little bit into the corner uh, and I now have a little desk over here. Um, a little uh, writing desk, yes. That's a typewriter, we'll get there in a second. But yeah, I, I restructured everything so I have a little bit more room here, which is really nice. I've started to feel cramped and uh, since I'm trying to focus on a few other things now, this is really neat. Yes, I know, I know, I know. It's it's for development. I'm gonna have to publish builds. And uh, yeah, down there, that's a Mac Mini that I'm currently selling. And Weasley is super chatty today. Um, super, super chatty. Super chatty. This is my Wheatley, you wanna Wheatley, you wanna tell us something? You seem you seem to be really adamant about telling us something. I'm doing a video here, you know? I'm I'm doing I'm doing a vlog. And you're just here making noises, trying to fit in and uh, be noticed. Yes, notice me. Anyway, I, I will probably go into a little bit more detail uh, in another vlog. Not right now. Right now I wanna unbox <laughs> a munch pack and 
a box full of Wheatley's food. Wheatley's gonna enjoy that. Wheatley, would you stop screaming, please? Jesus, you make it you make it really difficult. People are probably deaf right now at this point. Wow, guys, check that out. Lauren made uh, greeting cards, and they're pretty. Four handmade cards, yep, they're handmade, hand colored, and drawn partially. Part of it's a stamp. Part of it is a stamp, but yeah, it's... It was painted and wow, drawn. they're really, really pretty. Thank you. I'm gonna list them now. Wheelie's attacking my head. Yeah, he's stuck to my shirt. Great, he, okay. He, he can, he can not leave. He can always... <laughs> You can always leave. Go and check out Lauren's Etsy store. Link in the description below. Go and check it out. She has uh, dog toys. She has jewelry. Yes, I know Wheatley. You can come here if you want. Link is in the description below. I'll also link her Redbubble store because she makes awesome shirt designs and other cool designs you can get printed on. Anything you like, basically, you can get on Redbubble. I'm missing a thing to open packages. My, my, my knife thing. I don't know where my knife thing is. Wheatley, where's my knife thing? <laughs> Let's get started. Thanks, Ollie. It's Halloween themed. What's that? Zombie Nitro Habanero and Cucumber Tortilla Chips. That sounds absolutely disgusting. Then we got a butt plug. Ah, ugh, what? Ugh. What, what's going on here? Ugh. I, I, I have no idea what's going on here, but it doesn't, it doesn't look good. Ugh. How is this a crayon? You turn it, it's like Play-Doh. Ugh. 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 I guess it's candy, but it's disgusting. Well, that was interesting. Realize you never get to see the box like this. That's that's how it comes. All right. Corn snack. Ooh, that looks good. A maize corn snack. Salted caramel premium puffed corn. Hooray. That's that's not a whole lot of corn, I gotta say. What is this? Cocobis. Huh, what does it say? Wheat cracker. Okay, it's a wheat cracker with sugar. Okay, sweet wheat crackers, nice. Ooh, honey stingers. I actually saw those at um, Wegmans the other day. They're supposedly really good. Uh, they remind me of Belgian waffles. Let's, uh, I'll, I'll find out how they are. Ginger snap waffle. Hmm, sounds good. What are you, San, 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 Sankaku crackers? No idea. They look uh, vegetable-y, herby. Uh, this is another maize snake. I remember this one, or at least something similar. It's, it, it probably tastes exactly like the label says. It's, it's corn. Yay! We have those in Germany. I, m mana, vana? I, I don't know. Product of Austria, yay! Yum, 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 those are good. And a chocolate bar. Nice, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to eating all of those things. I have no idea what to do with this. Do you have any ideas? I just, I just want, I just want the sticker back. Can I, can I, can I have the sticker back? Thank you. Weirdo. I'm just, I'm just gonna take the tweezer if you don't mind. Okay, cool. Unboxing. Wheatley food. My safe bird store. A very special delivery. It's gonna be so tasty, Wheatley. I have no idea why I'm unboxing his food. Yay, freeze-dried peas. Ooh, wow, that looks good. I would eat that. Almonds, cashews, Jesus Wheatley, this stuff looks good. I would eat that, wow. <laughs> just, just check out how huge this package is compared to him. <laughs> You're unboxing my safe bird store stuff? Yes, I do, I do. And I'm comparing Wheatley. You're commenting Wheatley with it? A little bit, just, just a tiny little bit. It's, uh, it's a huge package. He, he wants it though, he knows that's the good stuff. Oh, I got a fuck ton of peas. Yep, freeze dried peas, you ordered this. I did, I don't totally remember everything that was in it. <laughs> was it was it a late night shopping trip? It was, well we lose out of food and we need more food. Ooh, just pomegranate. You're, you, did you really order stuff for Wheatley or for us? Because this stuff looks really I mean, good. You can eat some of it if you want. Oh yeah, I know. I already did. I already eat the freeze dried uh, broccoli. Ooh, look, that's for oh, us. This is just this store is adorable. Aww. If you if you want to get food for your parrots, this is where you get it from My Safe Bird Store because they always include little toys for your birds and candy for you. I'll, I'll, I'll link it below. I'll link yeah. it below. They're really really nice. Harrison Bird Foods. That's the stuff he gets. Yep. Good. Well, and totally organic pellets, but they actually stopped stocking them. So, so if you guys ever want to send us something for Wheatley, this is the <laughs> stuff you can send. This is the stuff he eats. As I said, he gets a special diet. 
Man, he's he is so excited. It's the crinkling. Oh yeah. <laughs> Very good. I have no idea what this is. It's like a dried piece of dragon fruit. Oh, is that for, for us or for them? It's for him, but he's really angry about it. Oh yeah. He's angry that we're holding whatever this is. No, he doesn't want it. Like, see, he doesn't care about it. He's just attacking it viciously. Well, you wanted more Wheatley footage. He got it. Wheatley and his. Did you just? Did you just? Of course he did. He just takes it and throws it because he's an he's an asshole. Jeez. Now he's really angry that we have these. <laughs> he's Brody Donut. He's so miserable. I don't know why he's so angry. Probably because he doesn't have any of those nuts. You know how he's gonna be the hap happiest and friendliest bird again? It's hard not having feathers. Here's oh, a treat no, for your furry treats. family members. Aww. Aww. Do they sell dog treats? Uh, Apparently. I don't think they do, but when you check out, they ask you if you have a cat or a dog. Oh. So I think the reason is because they want to give you little treats for That's your That's adorable. They're, they're really sweet. Oh, with little pumpkins on it. What is these? This might be human candy. Yes, it is. Yay, human candy. Yep, that was that was Wheatley food unboxing. That's that's uh, yeah. yeah that's that's gonna feed him for a while. Ugh. So much waiting. That's that's that's. I want to say thirty percent of developing is just waiting for the bills. Ugh. Or things to be installed or copied or synced. Good times. Also, you gotta check out where where surprise fish. Surprise fish. First of all, we have plenty of new. Shrimp, plenty. They're everywhere. Plenty oh, new shrimp in there. Ah, sorry. No, of course not. I hear your voice, and I'm like, oh, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> we have a surprise fish in here. We have no idea. The only explanation we have is that it comes from one of the other tanks, and as an egg, and then hatched here and survived. Because there's no other fish. There's two little fish in here. So maybe when I move the plant over from that tank with the Danios. It moved over, but yeah, two little fish here. I know Wheatley. I know, I know, I know. I'm excited too. It's it's super exciting, and yeah, he's just swimming around, eating like a worm here and there or a snail. Hey, I gotta show you when I throw an algae wafer in there, and then you see all the shrimp come out, and then they're all crazy about that. This looks so nice close up. I mean, it looks nice from far away too, but this looks really cool. Oh yeah, right. That that chopstick is still in there because I put like a squash in here every time. Every once in a while, and then they eat that surprise fish. Oh wow, yeah! Look at all these eggs, guys. Mmm, she is. What is it called? Buried is what they call. Buried, it. right? And I thought it was called buried, like buried in the ground, no, but it's buried, buried like the like berry. They're carrying a, a bunch of berries. Bunch of berries. <laughs> You're. I'm an idiot. I'm for a fish tank update because I'm still building a build. Check out, check out the snail. That's the epitome of being friend zoned. I don't know if that word is even correct. Doesn't matter. There's eggs all over her shell. Fantastic. Over here, things are well growing. The cardinal plant is like out of control, and I still intend to do a rescaping off of that tank and maybe even get a 20 low. Eat shrimp. More shrimp. There's so many little guys in here, it's crazy. Yeah, they're really hard to see because they basically have the color of the ground. Hey guys, check out these prints Lauren has made of her artwork, which you can get on Redbubble. I told you about that, but she made actually prints here and they're absolutely gorgeous. You can buy them on her Etsy store uh, in the upcoming days. I don't know if they're on there yet, but yeah, go check out her store. She's gonna put it up there and they're absolutely amazing. I think they look absolutely pretty. You guys should check out the listings if you're looking for some really cool art prints. There you have them. How about some nice macro shots of these guys? Ah, oh, they're so busy. So busy, busy eating. I'm actually just holding a magnifying glass right in front of the camera. And it looks really good. I, I do really like them. Uh, yeah, they're super active today. I have no idea. They've been buzzing around the tank like crazy this morning. I don't know. There's a little snail bro over there. You can see the remnants of eggs that has been on its shell. And there's a baby. Yep, there's a shrimplet. What are you guys doing? 
doofus. Who's, who's making a big fuss? Does somebody want his dinner? Does somebody want dinner? Is somebody hungry? Yes, every dinner bars. He, he makes the he makes this fuss every single evening while his food is soaking. It's like you're it's like you're starving. Are you hungry? Why? <laughs> the thing is, he's learned that it works for him. You are so talkative. Are you hungry? All right, all right. All right, boy. All right. Here you go. Such a fuss. Such a fuss. And of course for Jim. Here you go. Why, why, why are you so angry today, Wheatley? Why are you so angry? I don't know what his deal is, but he really hates my shoes. He's really upset at, at, at my shoes in here. There seems to be something about them that he's really not not too happy about. What? What are you complaining about? I can't help you. What did they ever do to you? Wow, that's that's some big pressure. I could feel that. There's usually not a whole lot you can do when Wheatley gets angry, but uh, the spray bottle usually does the trick. I don't even just spray him with it. He knows that it doesn't mean good. Millions of years of evolution have led to this. You can't get in there. It's 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 not working. He's so angry. He's really angry that my hand is in there though. Oh yeah, that's his food. That's that is his. He's so possessive. He's mixing the pellets together, asshole. Oh, that's how you do it. Yeah. Did you figure it out? Of you course. Can climb and you can fly and stuff. Oh. Don't you dare close this on him. Can't, can't squish his toes. No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I got! I got a package from Robot Gentleman, the makers of 60 seconds. Straight out of Poland. Straight out of Poland. Let's open this sucker up. I want to know what's inside. What, 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 what do we have? What do we have here? Oh my! We have a... 60 seconds can. I have no idea what's inside there. Oh, it's a can full of things. Full of 60 second things. Oh my. All right, we got a Robot Gentleman sticker. Nice. A 60 second sticker. I think those are stickers. Yeah, 60 second sticker. Uh, a business card with a steam code and more stickers so many stickers and i have no idea what this is i'm not entirely sure because it's not a watch i mean it's 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 out of plastic <laughs> i guess i can hang that around my neck all right i'll let you out jesus it's a pocket watch because i always wanted a plastic pocket watch <laughs> that's a rather interesting choice i i, I guess gentlemen have watches I like the tin. The tin is really cool. And I got a postcard from the nuclear apocalypse, it seems. What does it say? If anything survived the war, the nuclear war, it's the weasel by the robots. Aw, thank you so much. And we got a t-shirt. Yay! And I got a 60 second shirt, which is a little bit big for me, but I mean... <laughs> Yeah, it's 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 quite it's 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 a maternity shirt. It's a definitely a maternity shirt. So uh, if, in case I get a nice big belly, I can wear this. Thank you so much, guys. And uh, yeah, sixty seconds. I mean, what else can I say about that? Who's birds birds? Who's the birds 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 birds? Birds birds birds. What's up, birds? Why? I will actually be giving this away, the watch, the shirt, and yeah, I got the shirt in here, uh, and all the other things, including a Genki for 60 seconds. So if you guys want to win that, I'm going to put a link below the video. It's a raffle, and you just, you know, have to, like, visit the Facebook page or something like that to join in. Yep, I'm going to ship it to someone who wants to have these things. Ah, completely unrelated note, but my 
skin came. I really like uh, my laptop skin here. Uh, this is one of Lauren's designs. You can actually get that on Redbubble. Yeah, shameless plug. Deal with it. Um, yeah, it's beautiful. Look at it. Um, they have it for MacBooks. They have it for regular laptops. And uh, yeah, you can get the design on all kinds of things, but I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I got so much material that I need to cut down now that I'm going to do that now. Um, also, I think I'm going to put a video on the wheels on to get a new influx of people over here because I enjoy doing the vlogs, even if they're not as regular. And uh, yeah, if you guys uh, haven't watched it, I did a review of the, uh, what was it called? PC Free 7 Free D by Sennheiser. And um, there's a giveaway on weaselzone.com, so you can join in there. I don't know if I mentioned that before. <laughs> But yeah, you can join in that. Even if you didn't watch the review, you can join by just, you know, tweeting it out or just visiting my Facebook page, something like that. In any case, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, that's awesome.